Major story in horse racing over the last few weeks has been Jorge Navarro, the trainer, and of course the trainer of Sharp Azteca. There was a video that many people saw, maybe many of you didn't see it, involving him and one of his owners. It's been a big controversy. There were fines levied in New York, New Jersey, a lot of tracks not accepting his entries. Jorge Navarro is standing in the paddock with Gabby Gadette. Thank you, Andy. And Jorge, obviously, you have been the subject of controversy uh, recently after um, a video was released uh, back in the beginning of August. Jorge, what have you, how have you kind of reflected on this situation? And is there anything you'd like to say to the racing community about it? Yes, first, I want to apologize to all of them. Like I said, my wife, my family, everybody. I'm ashamed of what happened that day. All right, uh, I let somebody take the best out of me. And you know that's a no-no. A uh, guy like me, leading trainer, all right, uh, should be acting that way. And I do regret what happened that night. And if I have to apologize for the rest of my life, it's going to happen. I will. And Jorge, with certain situations like this, you know, when, when there's controversy surrounding an operation or when there's a lot of negative attention, how does that kind of affect the mood of, of you and of your operation as well moving forward? You know what? I want to thank my assistants. Jesus Christ. Uh, they were, they were there for me these last two weeks. Uh, if it wasn't for them, I don't know where, I would, where I've been. Or my wife. You would see what's a hard situation. Listen, this is all I know how to do. I know how to train horses. I'm a horseman. All right? And feeling that they weren't taking that away from me. Feeling that sharp as tech, I wasn't be able to run. All right? Hey, I want to thank the uh, Naira for doing this for me and the horse. It's about the horse, not me. All right? About me, I'm going to clean up. And like I said, if I'm going to apologize for the rest of my life, I will. That's the type of guy that I am. All right, well, we'll transition to the horse, shifting gears a bit, Sharp Azteca. He's really taken his talents to multiple different places. Jorge, you, you shipped him in earlier this week for a work over the track. What was kind of the purpose of it, and how did he look to you? You know what? It was a good workout. Uh, man, it didn't change. Uh, the reason I did that was uh, coming out of the Mammoth Park, it's a fast kind of track. Here it's a little bit deeper. So I see my horses after the race, how they come back. So that's why I'm doing that now. All right, well, how does he look to you today? He looks like he's on his toes. He's training really good. He's doing really good. Uh, hopefully he shows up. All right, well, we'll let you put the tack on. Thank you for your time, Jorge. Thank you. All right, Andy.